Home Management. I'm an actress and a writer um, and I'm from Warsaw. This is actually my third time applying for the boundary, so it was the third time lucky. Uh, in the period of um, the second time that I'd applied and, and not been successful, I went away and I wrote and self-produced a solo show and toured it and it opened here at the Rep. And uh, this time I think because I kind of had a bit more of a voice and I knew what kind of writer I wanted to be and what kind of artist I wanted to be, A Dangerous Woman is a personal story, it's autobiographical and it's about um, growing up in a family of six women, of which I'm the youngest of five siblings. And um, it's about the choices that each woman makes um, and what it was like for each of us growing up in that family. And um, the violence of kind of women against, against women, how you can be allies one minute and enemies the next. The inspiration first came from when I was reading this article about how Nicola Sturgeon was seen as the most dangerous woman in the UK and she was talking about how she'd taken the crown from Shami Chakravarti and they were both sort of like talking about how um, Angela Merkel was the most dangerous woman in Europe and it really just sort of got me thinking about what does it mean to be a dangerous woman and then I started thinking about my family and how I was seen as quite dangerous with uh, my career choice and when I told them about my partner, how just your choices in life can really sort of create earthquakes within a family. I think honest, bold and funny. I mean it goes to some dark places but it is, it is funny. I've been working on it for a year, so I would probably say the first sort of 10 months of that was just talking, so much talking about memories and we recorded so many conversations and I spent hours transcribing all these conversations with my director and dramaturg and um, yeah and then we read through all the transcripts and slowly slowly we started to unpick what the story was and what the thread was. Um, Yes, yeah, so that was probably a good 10 months of R&D and uh, now we've started to put it on its feet and it's about sound design and lighting design and stage kind of concept and so that's taken it to a whole another level now. It's very collaborative, that's one thing I'd say. It's been a very, very collaborative experience.